away, take it away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get it. Hey everyone, it's Fantasia. Welcome back to another episode of Disaster Diaries. So this is kind of awkward because the fam has just came home from vacation and look at who is outside. Straight away, they see him. Ava Lee sees him and I don't know. You can see they're over here and honestly not feeling the hottest like she is giving her dad the biggest side eye. She is not here for it. She has the distress again from being near family. Oh, she's trying to make her feel better. Mom of the year. Like, of course. We love this. We love to see it. I still stand by the fact that I think Avely is the best mom and honestly, I am so glad these kids have her. So other than that, she is feeling great because she actually vacuumed the vacation home before leaving, but she's conscious about her breath. You know, they just got home. She didn't even brush her teeth before leaving. So we are gonna make sure that we get that done. I was just like, what is this? But never mind. It's the... <laughs> It's the shared space. So she is going to come and brush her teeth over in this bathroom here. So we're going to get that done. And then as for you, little one, he is really hot. He's overheating. Let's get in the house. Where's our thermostat actually? Do we have one in here? I'm always just like, where the fuck is the thermostat? Like, does anyone else relate to me? <laughs> um, no, I actually don't think you would like cottagecore music like at all. Oh my goodness, you guys, we have to talk about a few things. There has been something brought to my attention with this save file. And let's just say I was not thrilled. Like I really was not thrilled. Obviously you guys know I am using a custom save file. I'll get into it in a minute. And of course, if you don't care, just skip through it, but it's going to explain what the fuck is going on with her friends. Like I was so confused. But before we get into that, I'm just going to go ahead and get them settled in. So we have all feeling heard, validated and appreciated. Oh, because her mom. Oh my God. I love that for her. Oh yeah. You have to go to the dentist. We still have like, she still has bad breath. Oh no. Are they fighting? No, no. Oh my God. Oh my God. He's about crush. Do you have a crush? Wait, are you crushing on April? Do you think you guys, do you think like I, do I have the preteen on my game right now? I'm not sure, but if I don't, I need to get it before you age up little dude, which is like so soon. Oh my God. Well, I guess if he does age up before then, like I'll just revert it, but I don't think so. If he has a whole day, we should be fine. We should be fine because I'm like, wait, is the preteen mod in my game? Because I don't know if I took it out when like all the mods broke. Um, and then, okay. What about you? Ooh, simmering rage. She's feeling insecure. She also still has slight depression, you guys, which like really breaks my heart. So I think she wants to go straight up here and we got to get you to the dentist, but let me go ahead and just like move this. Honestly, I don't, I don't know where to put this. I'm putting it here for now. <laughs> we need like a display thing, but let's go ahead and design jewelry. And we're going to do, I mean, she's just starting off. She can't even make much yet, but let's make these chunky earrings. Ooh, should we do that? I don't know. I want to see like what we can get and let's do sapphire. Okay. I'm curious. But yeah, maybe that will make her feel better. At least I hope so. So let's get you to the dentist, girl. Like, let's go. Um, So we're going to go in here, I think it is. Yeah, dental services. I don't know if she just has a cavity or what's going on, but let's go ahead and book her a dentist appointment for Araya. And then she should just go today. We should just have to like wait for them to call. So she's going to go ahead and do that. And then we're going to have her just continue her homework. And then let's get into what is going on. <laughs> so, oh, we have the appointment already. Oh yeah. We have school today. Should they all go? Mm, you know what? No, they're not going to all go, but I'm going to have both the kids go. So yeah, let's have them both go. So anyways, back to what I was saying. What the heck is this safe file called again? I don't know. I recently responded to a couple of you guys. Oh, we have too much going on. I'm trying to just explain this situation. <laughs> so essentially, I guess the creator like removed a bunch of the Sims pronouns and like changed sexualities and all of that. I'm all for doing whatever you want in your personal game. Obviously, it's your game. Like I'm very strong by that. Like we do have to remember that. Like if 
someone wants to play a certain way and change characters, like they are free to do that. But when it's a public save file that you're sharing with people to download, then I don't know how I feel about it. Because like, that's why I was so confused about all of these Sims. Like, first of all, not even realizing that these Sims are from high school years, like Ash, having no idea. But yeah, like that's why I was so confused about like these Sims being the same Sims from high school years like the original townies from high school years. If you look at Ash, like originally in your game, like this does not look like Ash at all. Ooh, Araya's teeth aren't coming in quite straight. The dentist strongly recommends braces. Should she get braces? The dentist can put them in today. Yes. Did she already have like fake braces on and now she's getting real braces? I think so. <laughs> but anyways, she's getting braces. Okay, I love the realism. But yeah, anyways, so obviously it was brought to my attention that this is like the original Ash. And then I was so confused because some of you guys were saying, doesn't Ash go by they, them? And then some of you guys were replying to some people saying, no, Ash goes by she, they, which I still, I don't know. All I know is in the trailer, she went by she, they. So I was like, okay, like, what do you guys want me to do? You guys are just all for me doing whatever, because obviously I didn't realize this was the original Ash. So at this point, it doesn't even matter. So I don't even, I don't know. I'm not even going to think about it. This is like, whatever. I might just keep it how it is. I might swap it. I, but my main concern is the other Sims. Like a lot of the Sims in this whole save file have been changed. So if I ever notice anything, I'm going to go ahead and fix it. I don't want to sit here and like fix everything all day, but I would like things to, you know, be how they're supposed to be. I had no idea when I used this save file for this let's play, if I would have known that, I probably wouldn't even have used it. However, this is a really good save file in terms of like the lot. And that's why I originally wanted to use it for this let's play. And so it really bummed me out. I'm not going to lie. And then supposedly Noah is gay. And then I was like, wait, that's the original Noah too? Because if you look at him, like it just, to me, I don't know. It what I mean, I guess if I really looked at them and created a sim, I would have realized, but obviously just glancing at them and I'm storytelling, I'm focused on my sims. I'm not going to realize, like I'm really not. <laughs> Like, I'm sorry, I'm going to overlook it because it's just like, obviously like Sydney, this looks like Sydney. So I know that that's him like from high school years, but I don't know, even the original Noah from this save file didn't look like the original, original Noah without a custom save file. To me, like he, I didn't even realize that was like, what? <laughs> so however, I, I was like, oh, storytelling opportunity. I think Noah would be gay. I like he originally is, but not in this save file. And I don't like that, but I think he would be because, you know, once we develop a storyline, not being aware that he was originally that way, maybe he would have grown into a Sim that I thought was straight. But no, I actually think that he would, this version of him, I still think he would be gay, but he's a teenager and I feel like maybe he didn't realize it. And then he hooked up with Araya and I feel like that's going to be an eye opening moment for him or like it was. And I feel like he's realizing he's not attracted to girls. So in that case, it's actually, I'm not even mad that he was switched to straight because now I can change him to gay how he's supposed to be and we can incorporate it into the storyline. So I like that. I, I really do. But we're definitely going to be bringing LGBT Sims back into the safe file. Like, yes, please. We're not about to be like, no. <laughs> okay. So she is getting some food out here. She, uh, if you guys didn't see the notification, she botched the jewelry. Like, girl, <laughs> do I even want to know what it looks like? Also, um, I don't know if you guys saw, but like Huxton was around and, um, yeah, <clears throat> he be trying to come around. So, oh, <laughs> okay. That is like another level of botch girl. <laughs> This looks freaking delicious, like yum. Oh, oh, unexpected light show from Broken Feet. Wait, what? I don't know what's going on. I really don't know, but we're going to get him some food as well. Hold on. You come over here. We're going to eat the same thing. Get some fresh air. I don't know what he's trying to go eat, but yeah, let's get fresh air. I don't know what he did. I really don't know. Um, but they've both went out the dentist. Did anything come out of the, like you going? I don't think so. Did Maybe we just brought him. Okay, here is the thing. Electrical failure. It looks like something has shorted out all power and electricity in this unit. Can we like get the landlord over here? Yeah, call property owner to visit. Let's do that. And hopefully he can fix the situation. But we need to go and see the baby soon because I don't even know. Like, have you grown up more? I don't know. Like, we've definitely been gone a few days. And I'm curious. So 
Did I tell her to invite him over? Wait, where is he? Oh, he's here. Okay. Hey, dude. Okay, so we are in Create a Sim, and let's go ahead and see if he's actually set to straight, because supposedly that's what's gonna happen in the save file. Okay. Okay, romantically attracted to men and women. Hold on. This sim is exploring romantically. Yes, this sim is interested in messing around with men. Wait. Okay, I'm confused. I'm confused. Is this save file making every sim straight and like all of that or not? Okay, guys, I need to know down below. Okay, cutting back in. I just want to check because I said earlier, I don't remember the name of the save file, but I did reply to some of you guys. I had to go back and check again. It's the Unfadia save file. I even saw some stuff online of people saying that to just be wary of the save file because it like removes all the LGBT sims and stuff and like changes their pronouns. But is this how he's usually set? Because maybe they're not all changed. Maybe the creator was just going with their own vision of how they saw these sims. Maybe some th sims are changed and some sims aren't because apparently what is her name? I think it's Molly that comes with high school years. Apparently she's still also lesbian. I was just thinking like every single sim was changed to not be a part of the LGBT community. Like that's just what it seemed like from what I read, but maybe not. So was Noah fully gay or was he like this? Like the original Noah without any custom save file? Let me know down below because I honestly have no clue. This is just like information that you guys told me. But for my game now, I see this storyline seriously happening. So this sim is romantically attracted to you. I'm going to do men because once you guys told, once you guys told me that, I was like, wait, I can see Noah end up coming out as gay. So I'm doing it. I, the sim is exploring romantically. Hmm. Well, this is going to prompt them to reject other sims that do not meet their attraction type. Okay. So yeah, no, I feel like he was. And then now he has discovered because of his best friend that he's gay. I actually, I like this little storyline. Okay. We're going to keep everything the same. And then while we're here, here is Ash. And I was asking you guys, like, I'm going to have to do custom. So I'm wondering, we can still do she and then hers. And then we can also do, is this going to make sense? I really hope so. Please tell me if I'm doing this wrong. No, that doesn't work. Okay, here. Bob told them about the best grilled cheese recipe ever. So we can do that. And then we can do themselves. Eliza made the best grilled cheese themselves. Hopefully that's not going to not make sense in certain situations. I, I don't think so though, because then we'll keep this the same. That burnt grilled cheese is hers. It's so confusing that they got to do it like this, but like at least we can do it. Should I just keep it like this? Because it needs to make sense in all different scenarios. We're not going to stress about it. You guys can call Ash, she, or they. It does not matter. Both is acceptable. Okay, so I'm actually, I'm very pleasantly surprised that Noah was still actually set to be attracted to men or whatever it was, but like was exploring too. I honestly think he would come out to Araya first. They're sitting at the table together. I feel like they're going to have a deep conversation, but like all the power is out right now. So I don't know, <laughs> like or not, not even just out, like everything is broken. So I don't know if this is the best time for them to have that talk. Um, okay. Just invite you in. I really hope you'll just fix this shit for us, bro. Like, come on, <laughs> come on. Uh, we might just have to, I don't know. Hopefully he fixes it because literally everything is busted. So if we go here and then go to rental, we can complain about the rental conditions. We can also, oh my gosh, girl, you almost just got a thousand. She always almost gets a thousand simoleons for her days off and we love that. All right. So then go to rental and then ask to inspect. And well, I mean, we need everything inspected. It's all broken. Oh my gosh. Okay. What do I do about this? <laughs> I'm a very much for rent noob still when it comes to this sort of stuff. I've explored the pack as much as I could in my little series to review it. But, and like, what is, this will immediately take you to manage worlds. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> so we've complained, but is he going to do anything? Dude, stop moving. Our whole apartment is broken up. I don't want to deal with it. <laughs> we're not rich. We may make a lot of money, but we're not rich. Boy, some of the items here is not even what the fuck is broken. What do we do? If anyone knows, am I supposed to actually just repair all these? Because, I mean, obviously there's repair service. Will they come fix everything though? Like, dude, <laughs> I low-key do not want to deal with this. I'm not going to lie, but I'm going to like, shouldn't he be fixing this? I'm, I, I don't understand. I swear he's supposed to be the one fixing it. I feel so dumb right now. Shouldn't he just, I, I don't know. I'm not dealing with it. <laughs> like how many things are broken? Okay. This, all of that's fine. I wish, okay, wait, is the stove busted? Is it? No, I don't think so. It seems fine. And then like, hold on. What about, I don't know what I'm doing. 
I, I'm right now. It's like I haven't even played this pack. Like straight, <laughs> straight up. Is it this thing? This thing. Okay. Call property. Okay. I know he's already visiting, but I want him to go fix this. I'm about to just have her go fix it because like whatever. We can also replace it, which would be real easy. Yeah. I think I'm just going to do that. I'm not going to lie. Well, how come like he wouldn't just go down there and fix it? Like, isn't that his job? I don't know. And then look, our shit is still busted up. That's like really like, please fix it. Please just fix it. Like he's cleaning, but rental ask to inspect share a unit this inspect our fridge and then will he maybe she's like i'll do it myself <laughs> the queen of i'll do it myself like literally did you finish your homework little bean you did not let's get that done and i want them to go have a conversation like i really do let's put them in a group add to group and then i'm gonna have them go up into her bedroom so we're gonna go here together i've been thinking more about like the bedroom situation you know there was a chance that i was gonna put a ray up here but now this, oh, this TV is fucking broken too. Now, obviously, this is Avalee's space, and I do really like that idea, her to have a place to just, like, make jewelry and chill. You know what I mean? Like, she has a lot. She's going through a lot. But now, with Jiraiya getting older, I think this will be his bedroom. You know, I've talked about how he just likes being with his sister. He's more comfortable this way. You know, like, yeah, and I think it was good for him, especially during all this. I think that was good. Okay, the, uh, this is all driving me nuts. Like, there's no freaking lights. There's an electrical outage, like, <laughs> like, will it, like, come on. This is fine. This is fixed now. I can't do anything with this. He's just down here. I don't know. I, I know how to deal with this when I'm the landlord, but being the tenant, I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do, to be completely honest. <laughs> but anyways, why are you crying? Why are you crying? Wait, I don't want to keep on pausing, but why? And it's dark up here. I don't know where they're going. Aw, what's gonna happen? Oh, they're hugging. Stop. Wait. No. Oh my gosh. Really? You're flexing. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go to friendly. We're gonna go to deep thoughts and we're gonna have a deep conversation and then we're gonna ask to just be friends because this is where like he's coming out to her, you know, and like she's been meaning to ask to just be friends and this is like the perfect opportunity for her to do that, you know, without even feeling bad for it because, you know, ended up being kind of like a mutual thing. Like they were always just meant to be best friends. Okay, decided to cool off their romantic relationship. Okay, perfect. I, I think it'll be fine, although he's very sad now, but I don't think, oh, I don't think it will last long since, oh my goodness, uh, since, you know, he's attracted to guys and that's okay. And, you know, I feel like Araya is so happy for him and she's like, yes, go find yourself a boyfriend. Like, oh my God. I feel like she is just like so excited about it to be honest so we're gonna go ahead and try to cheer him up i feel like maybe he's feeling emotions because like he just came out to her you know yeah he's just feeling a lot of things oh oh stop okay the lighting is absolute crap but we're gonna capture it anyways i mean kind of a moment the power is out and <laughs> they're just having like a heart to heart but you know so again like me like not realizing who they were originally like literally ash and him are brother and sister and like it is kind of weird that like obviously araya is crushing on ash and then she hooked up with him but like <laughs> no one's dating so like it's fine it's completely fine but it's just like kind of weird um so let's go ahead and do a smooth apology even though like i don't think there would need to be any apologizing here but like we're gonna do it anyways oh please forgive it is about 8 p.m and i'm wondering if she's gonna head out for the night like to hang out with ash somewhere you know um, I feel like maybe she wouldn't come to the house, but I feel like maybe she would go out. Oh, we have the thing now, the, the repair. Like, I was completely, like, overlooking that. Maybe we can go here. Although, like, I always feel like they're gonna be, like, hanging out by the bar, but they're not supposed to go in the bar. Like, I always think they would do things like that. So, maybe they'll go here, because I don't really think they would go far from home right now, just because it's getting late, but it's still, like, pretty early, I guess. Dude, why are you here? Okay, maybe it's just, like, hang out by your some we're gonna hang out out here oh my god stop we can tell them that you're my favorite 
Okay, let's do that. That will actually be so fucking cute. Why did emotional control just go down? Oh, yours did too. Oh, stop. Stop. This is literally the bar that her dad goes to. And like has flirted with girls. Oh my god, they're hugging again. Wait, why do we why why is there minus? I don't know. I don't know. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Um reveal crush. Do it. Do it. Do it. We got you. Okay, hold on. I feel like you also should change into your everyday wear. Alright, there we go. Oh my god. No, I'm gonna change that by the way. Like I really think she would be her soulmate. Like not to control things, but yeah, a lot of you guys actually thought the same thing. I don't know. I do <laughs> I don't see her with Savannah. I don't. I'm sorry. I feel the chemistry here, like, genuinely. Okay, so I actually don't know if there's a way for me to literally remove it. There is a way with the potion, but I don't know. Oh, can I just do this and remove it that way? But then what if I want... Okay, I'm gonna do that. But then how can I make sure this is her soulmate? I don't know. If we go into here, she actually doesn't even have enough. Like, we're so close. <laughs> So having tough luck in love. Drink this soulmate elixir to increase your odds of finding the one. And then this one gets rid of it, which I kind of just cheated that. So now I'm wondering if this will go away for her. I want this to become her soulmate. Please wait. What do you mean apologize? Demand a set what? I don't know what's happening. <laughs> the drama? Like oh? Okay, hold on. Do we try this again or do we not? Honestly, I don't know. But we're going to just do maybe something basic. Like some flirting. Let's... Ooh, compliment her appearance. Wait, stay here. Oh my god, you just freaking left. Okay, so it kind of seemed like she just like left with her brother. So what is going on here? So she's back. Maybe she just brought her brother home. We're gonna try to do flirtation. We're gonna compliment her appearance. And I'm hoping the fact that I like, you know, did it this way. The soulmate thing is actually gone. I don't know. What is this that she wants to do? Oh my god, she wants to become disliked by Huxton. Are you serious? She also wants to skip, skip class, dance to stereo music, and then complete extra credit. Okay, if you want to dance to stereo music, girl, go ahead. Can we dance together? Because that would be kind of cute. Um, let's, yeah, let's do that. Should we wind down with classical together? Like, why is that so cute? Let's do it. I don't know if they're actually going to go do it, but that would be adorable. Oh, maybe not so adorable. Oh, the mood's changing. Okay. Okay. I thought they were going to, like, fully wind down together. What? Uh, I don't know. Oh my god, slow dance together with Ash. Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! We just have to. Out here? I mean, sure. <laughs> I'm not mad at it. Stop. See, they're so cute. Like, ha like come on. It's adorable. What? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I feel like nothing's gonna go here today. Yeah, she's leaving. Okay, let's just, let's have you just be happy tonight. And we're going to, we can only wind down. Listen to, we want something like upbeat, like come on now, alternative, let's go. Okay, let's dance. Let's like get that completed for you. I rarely ever do my sins once. So yeah, we're going to be about that. <laughs> we're going to dance to the stereo music. It's not, oh, there we go. I was going to say it is not completing for her. Nope. I can't believe she wants to be disliked by her dad. Like I cannot believe that. But speaking of, we are going to head over to the household to see the baby. Okay, we are over at uh, the household and um, it's chaos. The power is going crazy. No, no, I don't wanna be here. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, where's your shoes? I don't know what has happened to a bunch of my Sims sho uh, shoes. Okay, you're a clumsy girl, sure, let's do it. So, oh, he's getting new likes. We have the coup milestone unlocked. Okay, we have a lot going on straight away. You're hungry. Let's feed her. Like, I love how you're just letting her cry. Um, feed, bottle feed. What is this? Aw, my pride and joy. Are you sure about that? <laughs> Unexpected light show. Wait, is it better? It's gone? Oh, thank God. Dude, feed her. You're for real right now? Okay, thank you. Aw, things are still a little crazy. I don't know what that electrical noise is. I don't know. I don't know what's happening. But she's back with her no shoes. <laughs> So let's go ahead and change your dresser, change outfit. There we go. All right. So these are disgusting, but is anything else going on in this fam bam? Let's see. Oh, okay. They're not really a fam bam. Let's be real here. <laughs> let's be so for real. I don't think really anything has changed. Um, so you are going to be, oh my God. 
Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What do you mean? What do you mean? Sorry, I keep repeating myself. Wait, wait, you guys. Okay, the lights keep flickering. They keep flickering. I can't even, I'm stumbling over my words. She's gonna age up. Okay, we need to, we need to end this episode. I really wanted to check on them and I'm glad that I did. She's gonna go to bed for the night, but she could age up at any time, like even the middle of the night. I think he was about to flirt with her. And then I had him put her to bed and it canceled out. But anyway, I don't want to miss the birthday. So we're going to be resuming the next episode or we're going to be resuming here in the next episode. Yeah, that needs to happen. And how do you guys think that's going to go about? Because like then she's going to be a whole toddler. Like we're going to have a whole toddler. She looks like she's doing just fine. Yeah. <laughs> She's sweating from working out. Like, she actually seems happy. I don't really know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's been going on with them. What's going on with the shadowing here? Don't ask. But yeah, I don't know what's been going on with them while we've been gone. Like, who knows? But all I know is that Huxton is still getting likes. So we will see. But with that said, you guys, I'm going to wrap this up here. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys. Then